day after the, the crash. Yesterday I spent uh, the whole second part of the day trying, looking for various options, basically googling stuff of, uh, of various uh, cargo trucks and car trucks uh, going towards Lithuania. Couldn't find anything. So I was starting to get a little bit worried as to how I'm gonna get back home. So that, uh, and then I went on to Instagram, Facebook and everything, you know, just trying to spread the message as far as I can so that as many people see it, so as many options as, as possible arise uh, for me to find, find a way back home. And yeah, finally today through a friend, I managed to find uh, a car shipping truck, you know, the one, the big one, which takes a lot of cars. Um, that is going back from Spain to Lithuania on Wednesday. Today is, I crashed on Saturday morning, today is Sunday, so three, three more days. Uh, yeah, and um, yeah, so uh, I have kind of like taken up the offer of them to, to go with them now. Um, but yeah, still looking, still looking for other options to see if it's possible to, to get on something anytime sooner. Uh, but yeah, at least I have an option now. So this journey of getting back home is moving a little bit more into a positive direction. Monday morning now, and uh, finally I have a confirmed date and uh, method on how I'm gonna get back home. So I have a car truck for sure coming in on Tuesday evening or Wednesday morning. Um, so yeah, still have to wait a little bit, but now it's confirmed that they will be here to pick me up and uh, yeah so the plan for today is to go to the uh, car repair shop where my car is currently at and I'm gonna try to change the front wheel which got uh, fucked during the crash and um, yeah put on the spare tire there so that it's easier to drive up the car onto the car truck okay so this is how the car looks right now as you can see the windshield's cracked. Yeah, the front end does not look too good either. I'm changing currently this tire so that it rolls easier. This is also no bueno. And then, yeah, the back windshield's gone. I don't know how this then happened. Uh, The job I had to do before going on the fat truck was to make sure that this is not leaking water inside onto all the stuff. So hello guys, today is Tuesday. Uh, the truck coming to pick up my car should be here either tonight or tomorrow morning. I'm not sure yet when. And currently I'm walking from this industrial place where my car is at and where I found a hotel four kilometers to the nearest town to buy a train ticket. Tomorrow I'm gonna give the car in the morning, walk four kilometers to the train station, take a four hour train ride to the to Madrid, then go to the airport in Madrid and uh, yeah, from the airport fly to Frankfurt and then hopefully back home while the car goes to Lithuania and should be there next week. Um, so yeah, but now just to buy the train ticket because the internet system is not working. I need to walk four kilometers there and four kilometers back. At least I'm getting some exercises. It's Wednesday and today should be the day where the car gets taken uh, on the truck and I get to go home as well. So yeah, starting of the day, the truck is late. Um, so yeah, I'm still at the car service waiting for the car to be picked up. 
Um, I do have a train in exactly one hour. Um, so yeah, I'll <laughs> need to help to get the car loaded onto the truck and then get a taxi, go to a train station extremely fast and uh, then take the train to Madrid. So yeah, hopefully that all works out and maybe I'll have some seconds to film a little bit of the action there as well. Alrighty guys, so I'm now going into the train station. I had to leave uh, the car in the in the service uh, without seeing it actually get on the truck because the truck is late and my train is leaving very soon so i don't know if it, if it's on the truck or not yet fingers crossed long story short i made it onto the train then i made it to the airport with no problem midway through the ride of the train i Got a call letting me know that the car was successfully put on the truck, that it's on the way. Then I was kind of like more calm and uh, continued with my journey, which went without any interruptions. Just empty airports in Madrid, empty airport in Frankfurt, and then I arrived to Lithuania. Now a week has passed and finally my car has arrived today to Lithuania. So yeah, the journey home is complete. Thanks for following guys and next video will be Back with the normal windsurfing video, good vibes and action from the water. Adios.